The Malaysian Bar Council organised the Walk for Freedom in protest against uh, the uh, Peaceful Assembly Act uh, which was proposed by the government. The rakyat look to the bar to advise the rakyat on what the law is, on what the law should be, and on this occasion, what the law must never be. This bill must never be law. And by us walking in a peaceful manner, we are demonstrating to 222 parliamentarians do not rob us of this constitutional right. Today, the Malaysian Bar came out uh, together with members of the public to walk for the freedom to walk. The Malaysian government intends to introduce into a statute books a peaceful assembly bill which the government claims is consistent with international norms and which will transform Malaysia into a progressive and liberal democracy. Unfortunately, there are parts of the bill, if not majority parts of the bill, which the Malaysian Bar find fundamentally objectionable. Uh, most importantly is the prohibition of a procession or what is called assembly in motion. Presently, in our police act, processions are recognized and allowed for, but by way of application for permit. However, this bill, if entered, if it enters in our statute books, will prohibit such uh, processions. This is what we find so objectionable. In any of the modern democracies, and recently as we see, Myanmar itself allow for procession. So we, are, we, the Malaysian Bar, we have drafted a very sh uh, short notice, uh, an alternative peaceful assembly bill, which we think is consistent with international norms and upholds the rule of law in the federal constitution. Ten representatives from the Bar Council were allowed to uh, enter parliament to pass the memorandum. And uh, they were greeted by members of parliament from the opposition. informed that the uh, Majlis Peguam uh, uh, have come to uh, submit a memorandum uh, protesting against the uh, Rang Undang Undang, the Akta uh, with respect to public assembly uh, because it's uh, very restrictive and uh, it still uh, tries to stifle uh, public opinion and uh, we are uh, we've come out uh, to uh, you know show them our support lah yeah nak sambut dia orang berikan sokongan ya kerana the issues that they have raised in their objections to the uh, uh, rang undang-undang uh, uh, are very sensible and it uh, and it requires our support uh, in fact uh, datuk sri anwar ibrahim just uh, finish uh, uh, his speech uh, pertaining to this uh, rang undang-undang and he has already requested that it be referred to the uh, PSC, Parliamentary Special uh, Committee, uh, untuk, untuk, uh, to, to be debated and to be discussed before it is tabled in Parliament. Yeah. We, we should go out and meet uh, them. We should go out and meet them. Okay, we'll go there. Meet them. Yeah. 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 We have delivered to the Deputy Minister uh, in charge of law, uh, Dato VK Liu, and also the Leader of the Opposition, our draft Peaceful Assembly Bill. In, a, in the last few days, I've also been engaging various parliamentarians, ministers, deputy ministers, in the hope that I could change their mind. We, the Malaysian Bar, urge each and every one of our parliamentarian, parliamentarians to vote according to their conscience and conviction and study our uh, proposal very carefully and not rush this bill into law. We urge the Prime Minister to not stray from his path to make Malaysia a modern progressive country, but to return to the right path on this issue uh, and uphold the rule of law and not prohibit processions. The Malaysian Bar works uh, very closely with the government on many issues which we support. But unfortunately, in this one issue, we find ourselves in disagreement with the government and we, we are confident the government will keep an open mind and continue to engage the bar 
on this and other issues. There was also this uh, small weird group uh, that had gathered outside of parliament uh, and uh, apparently opposing free sex. Tujuan kita pada hari ini adalah uh, untuk uh, memperdras gejala-gejala sosial yang uh, yang mana pihak sebelah sana tu dia Betul, nak sebelah. membuat satu perhimpunan aman katanya. Berselindung. Tetapi itu hanya selindung. Yang sebenarnya mereka ini nak menghalalkan seks bebas dalam negara Malaysia ini. Jadi kami sebagai NGO Islam dan menentang sekeras-kerasnya perbuatan yang terkutuk itu oleh Okay, uh, utama okay. kita. Okay, okay. Kami bekal okay. poli dan bekal tentu mengharamkan mana-mana pemimpin membawa kekotoran dalam parlimen. But let's ignore them and uh, get back to the uh, issue at hand. We speak on behalf of the members of the bar. The bar council speaks on behalf of members of the bar. But the people of Malaysia do look to the bar council to advise them what the law is what the law should be and what the law must not be. And on this occasion, we, the Malaysian Bar, we are advising the people of Malaysia and the government, the law must not be the current bill which the government is considering. We must continue to knock on the doors of Parliament to make sure this Rang Undang Undang doesn't enter our statute books. We must keep up the struggle with that. Thank you all very much and we will disperse peacefully. Then, after a few hours, the bill was passed in Parliament. <laughs> 